So here Marcelo's playing seated guard again. He has a uh, wrist and tricep control. Now looking for two on one on his opponent's right arm. Uh, again, the two on one, likely just being a climbing grip to, to get to connection to the legs or uh, get more upper body control with underhooks. And Marcelo ends up sweeping from the overhook position. Uh, let's look at that. That's really interesting here. So here is the two on one. Uh, and switches two on one on the other side. And now look at Marcelo baits this position by, you know, when he's hunting the when he's hunting the the wrist control and the hand fight. He changes and just, right, when his opponent, uh, his body language changes and hides the arm, Marcelo scoots forward and gives double underhooks. So he's made essentially, uh, you know, like a guillotine grip underneath, I think. He, I believe, tried to re-pummel to an underhook, and then when that wasn't available, went back to head control. So... It looks it's hard to tell from this angle, but it looks like Marcelo baits the double unders, uh, and so now Marcelo has double overs. He retracts the right arm, looking to pummel the underhook in, and that space seems closed. So he goes to start to block, uh, block the post with his left leg, and then the sweep it is kind of weird because it's not coming from a hook, so. Let's look again. Uh, it's hard to see what's happening because a lot, a lot of the important stuff is on the far side and we, we can't see with the camera. But it looks like right about there that Marcelo has uh, switched with the right arm and he's tried to pummel a right underhook in. Now he kicks with that left leg. So he, he let's look a little bit back. You see he stops from above the knee. Okay, and that leg is still kind of just blocking the outside of the leg. The sweep is working because his opponent's being pulled in those two opposite directions, really straightening his body out and encouraging it to, to you know, to roll uh, to, to his right, to Marcelo's left. And, but you'll see that, that far hook, you can, you can see that the Marcelo's right leg, wherever it is, like kind of over back in, in there, is, ends up outside. So the, the, the sweeping kind of assist from the right leg is almost more like a closed guard, like his, his right inner thigh is bumping and pushing his opponent's bot, you know, torso over and helping that roll. But again, you know, this guy, this pull, and that head control are, are the uh, important factors in the sweep. And, and Marcelo's just really using his weight to, to sink back and, and turn hard on the upper body with tight elbows to, to give that sweep some life. So we can see, uh, you know, try to pay attention to what's happening on the far side too. Even though there's no hook, he's bumping and ends up sweeping with a lot of connection, landing in the mount. Let's look at that whole thing one more time. So he's having trouble finding arms. His opponent gets, uh, you know, you see his body language really hides the arms. Marcelo invites the double underhooks, stays seated, goes to pummel the underhook again. I think it's not quite there. So he kicks that leg straight, drives over, and then just follows through with his weight and uh, lands in the mount. 